Welcome to Man Does Tech, where I solve the problems you didn't even know you had. In this video, I will explain how to use Figma on your iPad. While there isn't a full native app for design editing, you can effectively use Figma through your iPad's web browser, like Safari. Make sure your iPad is running iPad OS for the best experience. For more precise control, consider connecting a Bluetooth mouse or an Apple Pencil. These accessories significantly enhance your ability to interact with the design canvas and tools, making your workflow much smoother. Navigating Figma on your iPad involves understanding its browser-based interface. You'll find the familiar canvas and toolbar layout, though optimized for touch. Use intuitive touch gestures to zoom in and out and to pan across your design. You can also easily access the layers, assets, and components panels, which are crucial for managing your design elements. While touch works, a mouse or Apple Pencil offers greater precision for detailed work. Performing essential design actions on your iPad is quite feasible. You can create and edit basic shapes and text layers directly within the browser. The Apple Pencil is particularly useful for freehand drawing, sketching, and annotating your designs, making it great for brainstorming sessions. Organizing your elements with frames and groups helps maintain a clean and structured file, which is vital for any design project, big or small. Figma's collaborative power extends to your iPad, allowing you to share designs and work with team members in real time. You can easily leave and respond to comments, facilitating quick feedback loops. While full editing capabilities are limited, the viewing and commenting features are robust. Before we wrap up, make sure to check the description below for a link to a book that can truly change how you think about money, along with other great deals. Optimizing your workflow on iPad means leveraging these collaborative tools effectively. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe.